Nine straight years, Mr. Isaac Russo has been helping out at the State Fair of Texas, making crazy creations, and this one, I think, tops it all. This is the sweetest one for me, for sure. So this is the first one you've done this That's sweet, right. right? Like first sweet. sweet, nine years in the, in the contest. Okay. We, yeah. And you and, nailed it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you so? Wow. Yeah. I think so. How I did think, you come up with this? You know, we, listen, think about the State Fair of Texas. Yeah. yeah. Iconic foods, cotton candy, and then we have also been known for doing bacon. And we were like, "What do we do? What if we get these two things and we put them together? We could have never Why imagined, not? right? <laughs> of course. Well, first, we started with our glaze. We were like, we, "Let's make a cotton candy glaze." Well, that wasn't good. It wasn't enough. Okay. We went said, "Listen, let's order a cotton candy machine." Next thing you know, we're in our kitchen. We're so spinning cotton candy, and oh it's my. unbelievable. Like, so basically, we've taken the probably That's the, the bacon, the yeah. most delicious piece of bacon you could ever. Imagine. That's a good looking piece of bacon. Right, half inch thick, and then we add cotton candy. Oh, and we start wow. spinning oh, the cotton candy till it's just perfect, right? We just get this fluffy cotton candy around this half inch perfectly cooked bacon, <laughs> right? And then <laughs> once we get there, we just start taking and we start just mashing kind of it around, yeah. around yeah. right? Okay, wow. we get it around now. Well, I need a volunteer from one of you guys. Brandon, we'll step up. Brandon, okay, wait, wait, Brandon, you got to work for it first, okay? Oh, really? So we're going to we're gonna take this and we're going to get okay. this going. And you're going to put a little glaze on this, right? <laughs> right, so, okay, so you take this. We're waiting all week, you guys. And so you're going to just slowly go around it and torch it. There you go, there you go, right there. See how it's changing? Ah, okay. Oh, look at that. You are hired. We hey, need oh you at the State Fair oh, in Texas. That looks good. So, after you tried this, you have your creation. I mean, I feel like this is the number one on social media that is it kind of hitting been. all the buzz. Are you surprised I, at how well, crazy it is? You know, we were excited, but we could never imagine what's happened with this Already. product. It just blew up. It's and just we haven't even gotten to the state fair yet. Right. You know, <laughs> and so what's cool about it is, is that there's so much buzz about it. So people are so excited about it, and it tastes amazing, right? At the end of the day, it's really good. Oh. And so creating something sweet but savory. Savory yeah. and sweet, so I mean it's really, really good. So will you go with sweet next year? <laughs> you know, we are. We got to get through this you one. We're, we're really <laughs> how many excited. of these will you make? Do you think? We're hoping to sell thousands and thousands. We, I can't tell you how many uh, <laughs> pigs are involved in this, but, <laughs> no, no, <laughs> but, no, but it's no. going to be. No, but it's going to be a lot of fun. I mean, oh, we are. Oh, it's yeah. going to be available in uh, several of our locations. Okay, good. So you'll be able to find it at the Magnolia Beer Garden. You'll be able to find it off of Nimitz inside the Tower Building, the Holy Biscuit, in the Combo Plaza. So there'll be lots of places to find it, and you know it's really, really good. So. Oh man, it looks good. All right, State Fair of Texas kicking off September 27th. Uh, we're going to taste this when we come back, yeah, and then we're going to have a, a look at the forecast as well. Stay with us. Okay, now, yeah. Isaac, you said it's really key to tor the torch, because I thought, why don't you just put the cotton candy on it and make it sticky and fine, but you said the torching it really is key because it molds right. it to makes the bacon. It actually it, it glazes to it, right? Yeah, so, wow. So I'm going to make one for me, but you I'm guys. very impressed, but okay. I almost just stepped in front of this torch. So that don't would be, be shy. Jump in. Let's give it a try, That would have been some good TV. Oh, my okay. goodness. It's right. so good. Oh, I mean, the right. bacon itself is good anyway. You know, it just right. makes a lot of sense. I've had bacon with brown sugar, bacon with syrup, bacon with cotton candy. That's All right. Sweet this is perfect. You I do have a winner. Was... Thank you. This is really fun. I mean, I'm telling you, this is probably one of the funnest things we've ever created here. For I thought sweet. it was going to be too sweet, like I was going to yeah, feel I thought like, it was like, it was like, like a toothache, but it's not, not like that right. at all. It just has a nice glaze to it, the bacon, the saltiness uh, of the bacon. Right. You and did win us all from. Yeah. See, see, because at first, I'm sure. no, I'm sure. like, is it going to be too sweet? Plus, I was like, there was some serious skeptics here.